This is Stephanie Pitcher's Accent Challenge. Hello, PLG. Um, so I've wanted to do this accent challenge thing since I saw it on Tumblr like forever ago, but I, I, uh, I couldn't be motivated to do it because I didn't really give a shit who saw it and people don't respond to my shit anyway. So, I'm more than happy to do it for PLG, and I think it's just an interesting way to uh, see where we are all alike and how we're different, and uh, just either envy or laugh at each other's accents, regional accents, and so let's see how this goes. Um, let it be noted that I am from Boston, Massachusetts, which is known for its um, wacky fucking accents. So we'll see. Sometimes it comes out on me and sometimes it doesn't. But, um, okay, so I'll start. Accent challenge. My name and username. My name is Stephanie Pitcher. My username is usually StephXY. Uh, it's the one I've been using lately. Uh, I am from Rainham, Massachusetts, specifically Boston, Massachusetts, if um, you want to get a little bit more technical. Um, the following words. Aunt. Roof. Root, theater, iron, salmon, uh, caramel, but I do occasionally say caramel, but caramel is typically what I say. Uh, fire, uh, water, New Orleans, pecan, both, again, probably, Alabama, lawyer, coupon, mayonnaise, pajamas, caught, Naturally, aluminum, uh, GIF, Tumblr, Cracker Jack, doorknob, envelope, and G-Poy. I know that's some sort of like an internet meme type of term, but I don't know. Uh, what is it called when you throw toilet paper on a house? Uh, TPing. TPing the house. What is a barbly, what is a bubbly carbonated drink called? That's soda soda. What do you call gym shoes? Sneakers. What do you call your grandparents? I have different names. I've had a Grampy. I've had a Grammy. I've had a Nanny. Um, I had another Grammy. And then I had another, I had a Steve at one point. So I'm, I don't really know, but <laughs> Grammy, Grampy, Grammy, Valancourt, Steve and nanny so what do you call the wheeled contraption in which you carry groceries in at the supermarket that is a carriage a grocery carriage what is the thing you change the channel with TV channel with clicker it's a clicker or a remote but it's a clicker um, choose a book and read a passage from it oh shit alright mm, give me a second Accent's still, still the same. Um, I'm gonna read from literally the first book that I pulled off my um, bookshelf, which is called My Bad 25 Years of Public Apologies and the Appalling Behavior that Inspired Them. So, okay, I'm just gonna randomly. Um, I guess not so randomly, but, okay, and in quotes, it's, this is quoting, um, NBC. At the end of this past week's telecast of Saturday Night Live, a member of the regular cast ad-libbed a, ad-libbed live a gutter term, which we would, of course, never allow on an NBC program. We deeply regret this incident and are taking the appropriate action to preclude its reoccurrence, unquote. And then it says, NBC responding to 61 complaints from viewers by apologizing for Charles Rockets having said fuck on the air during a sketch, February 23rd, 1981. So, um, and then we have 
do you think you have an accent? I know I have an accent. Um, it comes out differently at different times, depending on where I am, who I'm talking to. It's typically stronger when I'm in Boston and hanging out with um, friends and family who are native to the area. I tend to lose it when I'm in other parts of the country and I'm around people that uh, don't share the same um, same way of speaking. Be a wizard or a vampire. Are you asking me whether I'd rather be one or the other? I think I'd make a much more convincing vampire. Um, I'm a little bit dark. I don't know. Do you know anyone? Oh, and I don't fucking sparkle. And I fucking don't go out during the day. Jesus Christ. Do you know anyone on Tumblr in real life? Yeah, I know many people on Tumblr in real life. Uh, same thing as I know many people on Facebook in real life. Um, what the fuck is real life anymore? End audio post by saying any three words you want. Alright, well I guess I'll go back to my book and... Um, Apologize. Inability. Misinterpreted. Hope that was sufficient. Yeah, that we only do that in Boston. Sorry.